If you're not aware, the new update, World 5 update, brought in a new world and a ton of new pets. This is a new world right here, and this has a ton of new pets that we can explore. Obviously, there's a lot of more NPCs that we can check out. There's a lot of more eggs and some new questionable training methods, including this wall punching thing, whatever it is, which I can basically like one tap literally all of these real quick. literally like my first time getting through that and i got like nothing for it bro so it's basically pointless doing that as well great Wait, what is the point of doing that what okay whatever and then you got pull up bars right here which are also pointless and they don't give you anything but one thing that isn't pointless is these pets right here actually i take that back most of these pets are crap but if we go to this egg right here the final and best egg it is actually very comparatively cheap Everybody thought everything here was going to be a lot more expensive, but it's not. And the pets are really, really good. More specifically, these three pets right here. The Gem Stegosaurus, the Gem Triceratops, and the Gem T-Rex. Let me actually go over to World 1, and I can show you guys the stats on each of these pets, and you will understand exactly how OP it is. So here we are at the index, and if I go over here, scroll all the way down, this index is arranged according to the amount of power a pet has so as you can see the tide has 168.30 and this has 174.30 and this is above it so if we go all the way to the bottom we can see that the glitch crab which used to be the best pet in the game is 800,000. the one after is gem triceratops the stegosaur and the t-rex are all ahead of that in this video i actually managed to get not just one but two ghost huge void gem stegosauruses right here and we got them legit we literally crafted them up and we turned them into a ghost via the mutate machine We got it! Yo, we got it! Oh my bro, chat, we just got it! 960,000 stats on that bad boy! Oh my days! But yeah, that's that. Now let's get on to it. So if I go over to settings, show your pets, you can see these babies right here. Ignore like most of it, they're just best friend 5 pets. But if I unequip all my other pets and equip just these two babies right here, that's what they look like. They literally overlap with each other for some reason. But yeah, these are the gem stegosauruses. And they're both huge void ghosts. The stats on these babies, 960,000 each. Let me tell you, the one before this, the pet that was the best pet in the game before this was the Ghost Glitch Crab with 800,000. So the difference is pretty insane. It's pretty crazy. So yeah, I really like these. They look pretty sick. The only thing is uh, they're literally, they don't have any legs. Just floating skeletons. If you actually look really closely, there are no legs in this. That, that's kind of weird, but whatever. All right, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to get my grinding team on. I'm going to get my glitch crab on, and then I'm going to get a lot of best friend five pets on. And we're going to check how much I get per rep. Alright, done it. So this is with the Glitch Crab and the Best Friend 5 team. So what I'm going to do is go over to Bunker. We're going to go Auto Train, Biceps. We're going to grab this barbell right here. And we're going to go to the final world. And let's see how much I get. Alright, I'm getting 364.9 trillion. Now to compare it, what we're going to do is unequip one of these Ghost Glitch Crabs. And we're going to scroll down through my inventory and find the Huge Void Ghost Stegosaur. We're going to equip just one of them for now and look at the difference. I am now getting 437.9 trillion per tick. Keep in mind, this is not with max friends boost or anything like that yet. Now, if I unequip one of my pets here, and I equip another one of these right here, uh, let's see how much I'm getting. Alright, I'm now getting 442.7 trillion per tick. So yeah, if you couldn't tell, it is insanely broken and it's insanely OP. 
next up, we're going to look for some offers for these pets and see what people would be willing to give for them. So while I do the trades, I'm going to go over to here, get the barbell right here so we can be grinding in the background. There we go. Boom. And get that. All right, cool. I'm just going to take like a subtle screenshot of literally like the best pets in the game. Well, second best pets in the game. Obviously, second to only the T-Rexes. All right, I just got offered three of the 120k pets. As well as a five best friend five. So that's a pretty bad offer. I wouldn't even consider that to be honest. All right, next offer, I got two of the 600k pets as well as one of the 800k pets. So that's a pretty nice offer actually. One of them is the 800k pets and the other two are 600k pets. So in combination, it is 800k plus 1.2 million, which is 2 million total power wise uh, for this right here, which is 960,000. So it's more than double what one of these is worth. Oh my god. Okay, the next offer is two 800k pets and three best friend five pets. Again, a pretty nice offer, but I'm not going to take it this time. Next up, we got offered 15 best friend five pets. Now, best friend five pets are really hard to find. But as you can see, I already have a full team of them. So I don't know if it's worth getting more. If you're not aware, three best friend fives is like the equivalent to one huge void ghost super crystal eye. So that is the equivalent of five super crystals. So if we actually look at it, it's not really a that good of a trade. But if you do the maths, we do 120,000, which is the stats of those, times by five, and you get 600k. So 600k worth of an offer for one of these, not really worth it. Okay, next up, somebody just offered me 60 huge void ghost blazes. Now, those would probably be nice to flip. Like, I could flip a few for a ghost crystal eye. And then flip them for super angels or something. Get up to, like, a crab. But that's just too long. I don't know if that's really worth it that much. Comment down below if any of the offers I received would be considerable for you guys. Would you take any of them? And make sure you guys join the Discord. It will be in the pinned comment below. I will be giving a lot of these World 5 pets away to you guys because I have a lot of spare. So make sure you are in the Discord server. I give away OP pets and game passes there. Well, even though that pet is extremely OP, 960,000 each, which is insane to be honest. And I have two of them, which is even more insane. Believe it or not, that is not the actual best pet in the game. If you go over to this final egg again, right here, the egg that costs 1.7 QI each, you can see there is a gem T-Rex. This gem T-Rex is 1 in 100,000. So it is the definition of rare, dude. But if you go over to the bunker, go back to the beach and teleport to Space Gym, then return to school. And we go over to this index right here, scroll all the way down. We can see the base stats of it as a baby is 130,000. The base stats of the Stegosaur is 120,000. And the Triceratops is 110,000. So the progression is by 10k each time, which means the gem T-Rex should be well over a million in power. Comment down below if somebody can get the correct maths on what the stats on this as a huge void ghost will be. I might give you a free pet, love. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.